morning class one how are you all i'm fine and it's time for your mental math class so all of you open your mental math book okay this is your mental math book all of you open your book page number 10 worksheet 5 look here worksheet 5 page number 10 okay today we are going to arrange numbers we are going to arrange numbers from smaller to bigger and from bigger to smaller okay mane smaller means choto and bigger means bado okay means lower to higher and higher to lower means increasing order or decreasing order whatever you want you can say okay you can say it in many very ways that is smaller to bigger bigger to smaller ascending order descending order increasing order decreasing order all are same okay so let's start our class look at the question number 1 see the numbers and arrange them from the smallest to the biggest number first one question number 1 a okay in the box you have given numbers 7 13 6 and there is an empty box given in the front of that okay you have to now write the numbers from smaller to bigger so which is the smallest number 4 after that comes 6 then 7 and then at last 13 Okay. In the same manner, B, C, D, E, F. You have to do it in your book. Okay. Next question number two. See the numbers and arrange them from the biggest to the smallest. We have done smallest to biggest. In question number two, we will do the opposite. Means equal to smaller. Nineteen three one eight. Nineteen three one eight. And same process. There is a box in front of that. First, you have to write the biggest number, which is biggest among them. Of course, nineteen. Right here. Then eight. Then comes. Three, then comes one. Question number one, smaller to bigger. Question number two, bigger to smaller. Okay. Now moving to the third question. Arrange these numbers from the biggest to the smallest. In the third question, there is a triangle.
14, 12, 9. And you have to arrange the number from smallest to the biggest. In the same process, blanks are given here. Smallest to biggest, so first is 2, then 3, then 4, then 6, then 8, then 9, then 12, then 14, then 15, and then at last 19. Okay? So in this way, you have to complete the full exercise worksheet number 5 on your book. Worksheet number 6, what comes before, after and between. You have done it in your previous class also. You can do it yourself. So it is your PW. Okay? Once again, page number 10, worksheet 5, CW. And worksheet 6, page number 11, it's your PW. So strengths. That's all for today's class. See you in the next class. Till then, have a nice day.